Welcome back to the shipyard, everyone. In the last episode, I built this 1 350th scale Cuddy Sark from Academy. While it isn't the first ship model I've ever put together, it is the first one I've ever painted, which brings us to today's video. The first thing I did was spray paint the entire ship flat black. This will make painting the hull relatively simple, as everything above the waterline is black on the real ship. To paint the white line that runs the length of the ship, I originally tried masking off the section to make the painting easier. For the most part, it was just in my way, so I opted for very carefully freehanding it. The box shows the finished model with two of these white stripes, and I've seen tons of pictures of other models with the same markings. The real ship, however, doesn't have two white stripes, at least as far as I can tell. There is one stripe in white, but the other one above it is more of this golden brown color, and the model doesn't really have any room to put that, and I don't have a steady enough hand to make it myself. The lower hull was super easy to paint, just brown, no complaints. I did do a couple of coats, the second of which being slightly darker than the first. While I had the brown paint out, I hit all the details that needed it on the deck. These included the hatches, the top of the railing, the sides of the crew quarter sections, the wheel, and the ends of the masts. The deck itself was painted in a light tan color. Having to paint the deck and all the details on it really made me realize that I should have painted everything before assembly. Live and learn, I guess. All the sails got the base coat of the same light tan as the deck. Next were all of the white parts. This included the lower sections of all of the masts, the railing at the bow and stern, the smaller boats, and of course, the sails. After that, I added a very, very thin layer of brown wash to give the illusion of age and use. The decorative part at the bow was very carefully painted gold. I also painted the little stand, too. The final thing I did was spray the entire hull with a clear semi-gloss. This isn't particularly noticeable at first glance, but it does make the ship look a little cleaner. And here she is! Painting ships is pretty new to me, so I didn't exactly know what I was getting into when I started this project. Clearly evident by the fact that I attached the sails before painting. Brush painting at this scale is less than ideal, too. Oh well. For a first try, I don't think I did too bad, and now I know what to do next time. The final episode of this series, I'll be attaching the rigging, so stay tuned for that. If you've enjoyed this video, consider subscribing, maybe leaving a like. Um, comment what I should try making next. Uh, I haven't done a plane on the channel yet, but there are plenty of those laying around at the hobby store, so I could attempt doing one of those. I have tried making planes before, but the keyword is tried. They're just not exactly... Uh, they're, they're not a very big interest of mine, so I haven't I haven't gone down that rabbit hole as much, but uh, Yeah, thank you for watching <laughs> Have a good rest of your day